Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to my War for Three. Hey, um, this, these are the last set of guns that we got. And then it's just the melees and the grenade launcher. But for the melee and grenade launcher, I'm probably just gonna add it to the interstellar video. And uh, you know, and not try to waste too much time trying to make a video that's only gonna be like a minute long. Feel me? But for this video, bro, I'm I'm kind of irritated. Um, last night I was in Elgato, bro, and I thought. I thought, I thought, I pressed record, and when I look back at the thing, I didn't record at all, so I didn't get any of the priceless shit, uh, me getting priceless on here, so I'm, I'm just, I just got, uh, gameplay of the guns in the background, but it's really it, bro, there's only six of them, six ARs, it's the SVA 545, MTZ 556, MCW Hogar 556, FR 5.56, and the DG 58, that's all it is. Alright, so for the first AR that we got is the FR 5.56. Um, with this one, all you really wanted was uh, 15 operator headshot kills while using a magnification scope. Like I said, um, this one is really uh, simple. All you had to do was just throw in a scope and try to get headshots. For me personally, I just went to hardcore, just get like the headshot challenges done, bro, just to make it faster. And um, yeah, that's that's really it, bro. When it comes to uh, the FR. 5.56 it was really not nothing too complicated you feel me so yeah man yeah i shouldn't really struggle on this one all right then the second ar that we got is the sva 545 <clears throat> excuse me uh for this one you want to do the same thing as the fr 5.56 get the 15 headshots while using a uh, magnification scope like i said this one is easy too bro y'all shouldn't have no trouble um if you do hardcore is probably the best option um like I said, I use hardcore just to make it go faster, and I'm not worrying about, again, OD hit markers. So, it wasn't too bad. It was pretty calm. Um, yeah, and that's really it for, uh, for the SVA. Like I said, bro, if you ever have trouble, hardcore is the best option. All right, uh, next gun that we got is the DG58. So, with this one, you wanted to get 10 burst kills. Um... I don't know if there's like a specific, I don't know if they want you to get one burst kill or anything, or you just get a burst kill. Um, so this one, I just, to play it safe, I just played it on hardcore just to get the one burst kill. But from my understanding, I'm just, I think it's just, it just get 10 kills with the weapon, basically. Um, so I just, I just went to hardcore and got the 10 kills that way. Like I said, because... Everything is one shot, one kill. So it's really, you really don't have to deep it too much. You, you feel me? So I think uh, I think that's the best way to do it. It's just I feel like hardcore is probably the safer option. Just saying. But that's really it for the DG58. All right, for the next gun, we got the MCW. One of my personal favorite guns. But for this one, you just wanted to get five kills without dying ten times. Um, This one, I definitely did off camera. Uh... Like before I decided to record this uh record this video, I was playing with my my brothers and my friends and I was just using a gun and I just happened to get priceless. Like my first game I played with this gun. I'm lying, it was like two games. I, yeah, it took like two games for me to get this uh challenge completed. Like I said, bro, all you gotta do is get a bloodthirsty. Um it, this one counted properly like it's supposed to. Like you really have to get the five kills from my understanding, so yeah, it's really it, bro. You just try to get bloodthirsties. If you have trouble, just go to shipment. Um, but if you use this weapon all the time, you really shouldn't have a problem doing this uh, challenge, just playing the regular quick play or whatever other game modes you want to play. It's, it's really not too shabby. So that's really that's really it when it comes to MCW. It's really simple. Then the fifth AR that we have is the MTZ556. Oh, my God. For this challenge... You wanted to get 10 tactical, ten kills while enemies are affected by your tactical. Oh, my God, bro. I'm just glad it was only 10 and not 25 like the Stinger was. Because, bro, man. Let me let me just stop complaining real quick. The way I did this one, like I said, war mode. Uh, I used war mode when it came to all the tactical effect kills uh, challenges. I think uh, they just work better for me personally. Uh, like I said, you could use shipment. Shipment would be cool, but the only problem I found with shipment was like everybody would end up just taking your kill anyway. 
Um, and it, obviously, they really don't mean to. It's just because shipment is so small. Um, somebody's bound to take a kill anyway. So it, I, I feel like war mode worked perfect for me when it came to the tactical effect kills. But apart from that, bro, that was good. Good thing it was only ten, cause uh, twenty five was pushing it. If I had to do it, and you have to be in tactical stance. I forgot, it has to be in tax stance, tax tax stance. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this one. All right, yeah. Then the final AR that we have is the Holger five five six, and for this this one you wanted uh, fifteen long shots while mounted. Uh, this one was also really annoying. So for me personally, 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 I did hardcore and I just did regular quick play on hardcore. Um, for some reason, every time I end up loading up into hardcore, I end up getting Wasteland or Derail. And those are the, those are the two maps I was able to get uh, this challenge done on. Uh, Wasteland was the one I got the most on and Derail is the one that I got like the last two long shot kills on. Like I said, bro, it's... Came in so clutch. Um, for this one, I would say you do hardcore, but you really, yeah, I say do hardcore for this one if you want it to go by faster. Um, this one definitely worked. Obviously, you can't use shipment for it because shipment is not a long enough map, no freaky, um, to get the long shots done for ARs. So, yeah, I say hardcore, or if you're really good, I just get long shots in general, just regular core quick play. But me personally, I say hardcore just to make it faster but look y'all i appreciate y'all for tuning in bro um like i said next video is gonna be the grenade launcher and the two melees but we're unlocking interstellar next video too so i just throw it in the video before i unlock uh interstellar hey man it's, it's been a grind it's been a grind but i appreciate y'all for being on the journey with me and i see y'all in the next video peace